Hey. Was it all right? Mm, all normal. Yeah. Headache? Mm. Terrible headache. <laughs> but I'm sure I could have gone home. Ah, just relax. It's all good. You know, get the VIP treatment. Mm. Hey, um, is Nick around? She's not picking up, and I thought she might be here. Uh, yeah, well, she, she was here, but then she was called away. Oh, who by? Uh, by a nurse. It was, I think it was a work thing. It wasn't about a patient, nothing like that. Oh, what then? Some admin problem. Oh, OK. Well, um, I'll go look for her then. But I, I don't even know where she went. She'll be chasing her all over the building. And every babysitting hour costs money. But if she, look, if she comes back, I'll, um, I'll send her packing. OK. Well, just as long as she's not overdoing it. Oh. And how's the nose? Oh. Sore. <laughs> Come on, get yourself off. OK. Well, do you need anything before I go? No. Good. No, I'm OK. Yeah. <laughs> Drive safer. Kiss those boys for me. Yeah, we will do. We'll see you tomorrow. Mm. <sighs> Nicole Crusay-Miller, how dare you not answer your phone and how dare you make me lie for you? What do you mean? You're home. Hi. Man, what a party. We barely saw each other. Well, you were pretty busy. Oh, uh, you got called away. Oh, couldn't be helped. Well, mm, I've got you all to myself now, though. I'm not staying, hon. Eh? Mum needs me at the hospital. Oh, why? What happened? Oh. Nothing. She's, she's a bit on edge and not sleeping. Yeah, yeah. She seemed a bit tense when I saw her. Oh, oh, so what was this whole admin crisis you got caught into? Oh, it's not even worth talking about. No, you should charge for your time. I should get going. Being back on the waters bringing back bad memories for Mum. Mm. Well, I didn't stay there. Mm. So I said I'd take in some of her things and stay tonight. Well, you're too good. Oh, not really. Um, you got time for a cuddle before you go? If I happen to be with you, I will not want to get back up. Mum's mm. waiting. So. Yeah, OK. You look tired anyway. Yeah, and the boys will be up and around before I know it. They will. Yeah, you're a really good daughter. I love you. Who's that? It's just me. I just bought you and some of your things. Where have you been? I have tried to call you twice. Uh, my phone was switched off. That's not what I asked. I've had Vinny here looking for you. Yeah, I know. So where were you? Just with a friend. Oh, is that what you call her? You were with Ruby. Please don't tell Vinny. Oh, so it was more than a kiss this time. You went with her and you and you and you. Oh, I'm sorry. How could you, Nicole? I don't. I don't know. I just did. Cheating on Vinny. No, I still love him oh, more than anything. Easy to say. No, I mean it. I, I never want to hurt him ever. What are you doing now? Lying to him? If he never finds out? Do you really think you could live with that? I don't want to lose him. Yes, but it's not just about him. What about those precious little boys? Yeah, I know. I made a mistake. I was confused. Whether you're gay or straight? No. Well, whether you want to be married or not? No, I do. <sighs> can, you, can you please just stick to the story? I was called away on admin business. I should never have said that. I'm so grateful that you did. I'm begging you, Mum. Please don't tell him. What did the that tell you? I'm sick with guilt. Oh, I wonder. What did you say? I've always been like your father. Oh, no, don't you dare start on the... years. Even produced a child. And all that time, butter wouldn't melt. I'm nothing like him. This isn't the same. <gasps> I'm just glad he didn't swing both ways. I wouldn't have known who to trust. Poor Vinny. I'm not a serial cheater, Mum. Yeah? How do I know that? Because it was one time. Just like it was one kiss. I meant it to be. Oh, is that Ruby? I blame her. No, it's not her. Well, you'd put all the stupid lesbianism behind it you. It's not stupid, and it is not her fault. It was me. I just... I, I needed to break out. Of your marriage? Oh, so, so it's a prison now, is it? What does that make belly? Stop it, you're twisting my words. <sighs> You could have gone on a shopping spree, got a tattoo, dyed your hair blue, anything but this. I said that I made a mistake. What more do you want? Well, I want you to swear on your mother's life that you will never, ever see that woman again. I won't. I swear. You'll cut her off completely? Yes. All right, then. You won't tell Vinny? I won't tell anyone. Thank you. 
but don't think for a moment that I'm okay with this because I'm not. I'm ashamed of you. I'm ashamed of myself. Good. I hope that chair is as uncomfy as it looks. Yeah. Wow, you're a villain here. Come on. Well, that was the point. Man, you're like a ninja. Hey. Who's gonna bring you breakfast in bed? Oh, she's good, isn't she? Mm -hmm. Oh, how's Leanne? She saw that she'll survive. Well, you're not looking too flesh yourself, to be honest. I mean, you're beautiful. You're right. I'm, I'm not feeling that great. No? Pretty rotten, actually. What, are you coming down with something? No, I did something. Mm. Can you just let that go to voicemail? Oh, no, it's Michael. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, would love that. He wants to come home this morning. What time? Awesome. All right, we'll see you soon. Well, I'd say blame it on the booze, but we can't. What? For you, feeling the way you're feeling. Well, you, you didn't drink too much, did you? Well, no, I just had a couple, not much at all. Oh, OK. Well, um, uh, I'm going to go pick up Michael. Can you save me some of that French toast? Oh, and what were you going to say before? No, oh, it doesn't matter. Huh. OK. Ooh, wow. She's one night away from the Vincent. You can't get enough. You know it. All right. Hey, but tonight, I want you in bed really early, okay? Bye, buddy. Good. I tried to do the right thing, though, but I couldn't. Bad timing. What right thing? Tell Vinny. Don't you dare. No, I feel sick. Vinny can see it. Well, make something up. Tell him you ate a bad sausage roll at the Christmas party. Oh, I can't keep this from him. I'm dying here. This is not about you. No, I know. It's about Vinny. No, no, no. You just want to make yourself feel better. Get it off your chest. Feel the relief. Well, yeah. <sighs> and crush Vinny to the core. So I'm supposed to just keep lying to him for the rest of my life? We'll take it to the grave. First time I've been grateful that my life will be shorter than yours. I don't think I can do it. Look, it will get easier once Ruby is out of the picture. How much notice do you have to give her? I can't fire her. That's illegal. That is the deal we made last night. I said that I would stay away from her, and I will. Find her another job, then. In a posh private hospital. Saudi Arabia, preferably. Mom. You can't keep being in the same building with her, and you can't keep her working with Vinny. That is just cruel. Still not fair. I mean, this is her job, her career. None of this is fair. You made your bed and you're laying it with a lesbian. So fire that girl. ASAP. Hey, bud. Hi. Remember what your dad said this morning? You're not too old for hugs. Bring it in. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's better. Are you still puking? Dad said you're sick. Yeah, oh, how are you feeling now? Well, I'm not surprised she's a bit off colour. <laughs> Sleeping on that chair next to me all night. She gets the Daughter of the Year medal. I'm sure I can see a bruise under your makeup. Hmm? No, <laughs> nothing gets past you, does it? Do you need a hug too? Oh. <laughs> oh, I didn't know I did until now. I don't know what I'd do without you. Do you like a tea? Oh, yes, please. Didn't remember that, did you? Your family is my family, too. Just thought about yourself as usual. Mum. What are you talking about? Leanne was just teasing. No, she wasn't. Nothing gets past me. Will you go and help your dad, eh? See if you can find some bookies. If 
You lose them, I lose them too. So perk yourself up. You're not sick. You're a very happy wife and mother of two. Hmm? Happy. Happy. Happy, happy, happy. You're not fighting. You're mad at her. Oh, rubbish. Disappointed then. I'm not mad. I'm disappointed. That's what my mum says. I forget sometimes you're a mum too. I am. So what does she do? Spend too much money? Is that it? Is she hiding it from Dad? Because I won't tell. Nothing like that, Michael. Then what? Nothing, Michael. But I heard you. Look, just leave it, OK? I don't want to talk about this again. What's going on? Oh, it's a bit short. I'm sorry, Michael. It's just the pain getting at me. Yeah, well, are you on top of your meds? Mm-hmm. OK. Well, come on, buddy. Let's let Leanne rest. They will get back outside. See you soon, Mrs. Jacobs. Bye. Can't stop thinking about Ali and poor Lucy. Yes, I know. Everyone's really worried about them. And I just heard about TK, too. Nicole. But, yeah. I woke up with the biggest smile, and all I could think about was you all day. Sorry about that. I no, don't apologise. All I've been able to think about is Vinny. Yeah, that's tricky, I know. I haven't said anything to him. Do you want to? Well, I can't keep lying to my husband. My mother can't keep lying either. What's it got to do with Leanne? She guessed what happened. Well, she's not going to blab, is she? No. As long as I keep my distance from you. Is that what you want? I don't want to hurt Vinny. I love him. I'm sorry. I really am. Do you want me to resign? Meaning what? You're out of a job because I made a mistake. <laughs> Believe me, I don't have any regrets. I didn't make a mistake. Well, where would you go? Well, I'll work something out. My fault for falling for the boss. I, none of this is your fault. No, it's okay. No, no, it's not. Just stay. Really? You're in the PSC and... Vinny works downstairs mostly. It's not like we work closely together anyway. True. More importantly, we're all adults. Grown up has. Mm. <laughs> what about Leanne? I'll work something out. <laughs>